So one of the first things I should explain really is the school's name. Dulwich Prep Cranbrook of course isn't in Dulwich, we're in the beautiful world and countryside an hour outside London here in Kent. And alongside our, our brother school, Dulwich Prep London, we form one of the biggest prep school trusts in the country. Here we have boys and girls from the ages of two and a half through to 13 in a beautiful 50 acre site uh, with huge opportunity uh, and uh, a whole range of activities on offer for the children uh, learning both inside and outside. So one of the things that we benefit from here is space and as you can see uh, we have this beautiful wheeled and countryside in which the children can, uh, can play and learn. Uh, one of the things year three were doing yesterday was getting out into the grounds and using an app called Seek to uh, use image recognition software to look at fungus. Uh, wonderful names like apricot jelly and uh, the leafy brain and they came across all of these wonderful specimens. So our space and facilities here also bring opportunity and the children have a whole range of opportunities in sport, art, music and drama uh, from the wonderful environment they've got here. Uh, year six, for example, this term are performing their play, which would normally happen in our theatre, outside in the Rose Garden and in the Nature Reserve. And we're lighting that uh, to make a, a really atmospheric performance of the Grimm's Fairy Tales, which will be live uh, for parents later on this term. There's no real Id ideal age for, for coming to, to join us. Um, inevitably, Nash House, which houses our nursery and reception, uh, is a very popular entry point um, so that children can, can start their careers and form that foundation um, of their education from the very beginning. But of course, we have parents moving to the area um, throughout the year um, and, uh, and are beholden to the housing market. And so where we have space, we accept children into, into every year group uh, throughout the school year. And uh, our form teachers are wonderful at helping the children to settle in quickly um, and pairing them up with, with a lovely body so that they can really hit the ground running when they join us. If you're looking for entry into nursery, uh, particularly if it's mid-year, so a January or April start, then my recommendation is to register children sooner rather than later uh, because we do operate uh, a, a system of, uh, of entry uh, subject to date of registration. However, that said, uh, wherever we have, have space, uh, we do try to fit children in um, as and when they can join us. So the fantastic, uh, the fantastic thing about uh, where Dulwich Prep is located is uh, is the really, really marvellous uh, senior schools that are available to, to all our children, and uh, and we are preparatory by name, preparatory by nature. We really do prepare children for uh, any future school that is the best fit for them. So uh, the majority of our children do carry on through the school to, to year eight, uh, where they'll set common entrance or scholarships to schools such as King's Canterbury, Benenden School, Tunbridge, Seven Oaks, uh, and of course, being in Kent, we have uh, our wonderful grammar schools which are on our doorstep and so we do support 11 plus entry to those grammar schools uh, in Tunbridge, Tunbridge Wells uh, and of course in Cranbrook just around the corner from us. My best advice for anyone looking to, to move to the area is to come and visit us. Give me a call or send me an email and we can arrange a tour for you. Um, and, uh, and let me know what your child's interests are and we can bring those areas to life as, as part of the tour and, uh, and give you the best possible um, idea and feel for, for what we're all about. And, uh, and thereafter, if you want to proceed to the next stage, it would be a taster day uh, for your child and we'd find a day uh, where the timetable reflects what your child most enjoys and as part of that day they would have an informal assessment uh, in reading writing and maths it's not a pass or fail it just enables us to understand um, the level that your child is is working to currently and uh, so they can hit the ground running uh, should they join us mm -hmm.